I started blogging in 2003 before YouTube even existed. It is with heart wide open that I share with you my journey that has taken me from South Korea to now living off grid in the middle of nowhere. I don't know why, but my back is sore, so I'm uh, physically limited. But I think it'll come back over the day because I've been stretching, and usually when I stretch, it comes back fairly quick. It happens, you know, once in a while. Anyway, uh, Willow, will you help me? <laughs> What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna build myself a little shelf for inside the house, next to the dining table. Uh, it'll be better. So it's very simple. And then I'm gonna start cutting these guys for the roof. Uh, today is that day. All right, let's get started. But first, I'm going to uh, start the water for filling up the pool today is probably gonna be the day it's filled completely filled so oh yeah you know what I'm gonna get stuff that I need to fasten one of the pipes on the system just all right I've got everything I had a little distraction with with uh, <laughs> it's not age <laughs> at all um, so I had distraction with the goats they were so noisy and then uh, when they're like that it's because they want more food the hay is low in there like there's still hay but it's low and they let me know <laughs> so I know them you know I can I understand them so I had to uh, bring some more hay in there and uh, in the pro the hay is in the woodshed and in the woodshed uh, I noticed a robin's nest yesterday and uh, there's no eggs in it but Today when I walked in, I scared the robin, so I guess we're gonna have eggs at some point in there. I'm just worrying about uh, how uh, Bond's gonna react to that if he finds them, you know. I diverted because I think it's time to open the greenhouse. <laughs> yeah. It's good. It's like uh, 20 in here, so pretty good. Oh. I was running out of time to get started on this because I like when I work uninterrupted. So I did something else that is uh, less, uh, won't take as much time, so I can do it. And then this afternoon I start on that. So yesterday I soldered my two pipes like this. And uh, now I installed it. I installed this. I unseized the vent. There's no fire, but my first step is to see the, if the water works. So let's do that. It's all ready to put some water in there and see. Let's see. It should come out from the bottom. It's not coming out the bottom. So it's a good thing I'm checking that now. Okay. I'm gonna go get uh, some piece of metal that I can go in there, put in the tube, see what's gonna happen. Well, the pressure did it, because uh, when I came back with my uh, tool, <laughs> it was working, so that's excellent. So now I'm going to start a fire in there. And uh, I'm going to put the other copper pipe. Oh, no, that's not what I want to do. 
just this. Uh, I'll put the other copper pipe. I have to put uh, Teflon tape, I think, in there. Anyway, let me uh, get ready for test two. All right, it's ready. I'm gonna let the fire really start to kick in. I'm gonna close the door and then I'm gonna add some uh, some water and see if the water gets warmer. I'm gonna go get like something to test the water because it looks like it's hot, it's smoking there. All right, let's see. Oh, it's not hot at all. But, no, it's, it's not cold either. Yeah, there's too much flow. It's still cold. Oh yeah, this is warm. Let's see how warm it's gonna get, and then I'll increase the flow. I'll get more wood. So it must have been a good 10 minutes now. The fire is pretty good in there. The water is definitely warm. Oh, now it's getting much warmer, yeah. Oh yeah, now too, actually, it's too hot now. So that's good. Oh yeah, this is too hot. Maybe not quite, but it's almost burning my fingers. So I'm gonna increase the flow. It's probably colder now. <laughs> oh yeah, it's still pretty warm. And it's getting warm enough that... <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's pretty good. If the swimming pool is at that temperature, it'll be good. <laughs> but now it's cool enough. Okay, I'm gonna add more wood. <laughs> Alright, my other thinking is, what if I put the holes at the, at the bottom and the out at the top? Will it make the, hot, the water hotter at the end, I don't know. I'll have to check that on uh, the internet. One of the things I uh, thought would happen is like I would have sparks coming out of the chimney, but I don't, so with that I was worried about the, the pool house which is made of poly. It would have uh, made a hole in the poly immediately, all right? And this is fine. This is not as hot as it was earlier. I know if the water would stay longer in the stove, it would, it would get warmer. But I don't see myself cutting it open and weld another coil in there, you know? But that's really what it needs. Because this is just a U shape going to the back and coming back. So it's, there's not that much surface to heat up the water. Mm, 
we have a load of gravel that I have to unload and this is a stand-up freezer we're gonna use for storage we got it for free but I have to uh, I'm gonna wait until my back is better I don't need to do that until uh, Sunday at the latest okay so this afternoon I start cutting I don't know if I mentioned that, but uh, this morning I started with the chicken that's sick in the house. And uh, I was able to get the egg out of her fairly easy, because uh, it was almost completely out anyway. But she's not doing good, she's quite lethargic. So uh, I'm letting her be and we'll see. We might be losing another chicken. Hey, Raven, ow, 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 ow! We must be close to being full now. Oh yeah, very close. I'm gonna give it, uh, maybe tomorrow I'll do another. Oh, today, that's pretty good. But I, I have to start with more water and the water is at, is it? 58. <laughs> it's not warm. Day two of cutting these uh, members. <laughs> I have uh, an update. So I'm still really not doing well with the back. I'm stretching, but uh, I've dealt with this injury before many times. It's not an injury, it's just tight muscles. Not sure which one it is, but uh, other times, like it's just the stretching. So, and now that I'm moving, it's a little bit better. So I'm going to be uh, powering through and uh, be very aware of uh, the balance, you know to make sure I don't overdo it because really there's no time frame on this uh, especially with the weather not uh, giving me like a, a week just no rain for sure you know that's kind of what I'm hoping because I think in a week if when I have everything cut in a week I probably can get it like framed and covered so judging by the way it went for this uh the front that i want to do like as a as a deck um that i won't have time in a week i, I have to order the product and all that so i will take some time uh but i can manage you know if it's just that part that needs to be waterproof so now uh, Widow's gonna keep me company. He's so cute. Vine is um, is going to town, <laughs> to the big town, and I'm gonna be alone here for a while. So that means I have to go to the medium town twice in the same week. Uh, I'm really uh, happy we can do that because I think it's important. If we didn't have that opportunity, or if I was like divine you can't do that or we don't have enough money or then uh, that would change in the quality of the life we have here we have a certain quality because we have the means to do this and i feel once we uh, figure out you know like somebody that can house it for us uh, once that's figured out, like it's gonna improve even more our 
level of freedom because we're gonna have even more flexibility on uh, following our hearts. <laughs> All right. Okay, I'm gonna get started. But I did 35 because uh, I want to keep one as my template, the one I've used for all of these guys. I'm going to keep it and I'm going to keep the other one, the upper one, so that uh, if I need to do more later on or replace, I don't know, I have it ready to go. All right, it's full. It's perfect. I'm gonna start this. Should be ready to go. Oh, there's a bunch of sand that came out. That's not bad. The first phase of pool season has been uh, reached. We're starting in phase two now which is going in the water but phase two also implies hooking up something to heat it up faster so I'm gonna bring the wood stove over there when uh, my back is uh, good okay so I'm going back in the shop I'm gonna start to uh, doing the upper ribs <laughs> or whatever from uh, my uh, arches so this will go even faster because I don't have the bird's mouth notch to do and uh, it's just two cuts it's really quick so I'm gonna set myself up I've got uh, 34, I got 35 to make. Okay, I cleared up so that tomorrow I'm ready to start doing the gussets and I should be able to do that, no problem, tomorrow. And then uh, maybe go hunting and rest my back and then I have to unload the trailer. And then it's a matter of waiting for the right weather window. <laughs> always changing the weather is <laughs> oh my god look at that who is on the table now she was nibbling me she likes to nibble so she gets all excited and she's been like pet me let's look at her yes see she's nibbling my knee, but it's she nibbles and then she's gonna nibble your skin, you know. But how did you get up there? Yeah, I'm not gonna get marimas again. Judging by my knee, I'm uh, it's too much. <laughs> this morning, it's the same kind of weather. <laughs> it was raining a lot of the night, so. To the point where it even leaked uh, inside uh, through the roof, so it meant I had to go on the roof. But my back today was still 
haunting me. Um, but I managed to bring all the plywood for the gosset in here. And uh, I also went on the roof to manage the, the water. So I removed all the water that was pulled there and let everything dry. And then uh, just before it rained again, I reinstalled everything. So now it'll take a while before it uh, leaks again. So, um, and uh, I unloaded the gravel and took the freezer out of the trailer uh, using my brain more than my muscles <laughs> so that it'd be as easy as possible. Okay, well that's the number one done. I got 34 to do. Uh, I will replace the one I had made with OSB. I think this is way stronger uh, over time. I think that's really gonna prove to be a good choice. So uh, I'm gonna pile them up. She's cleaning them, there's two. Oh, maybe. I'm gonna hold. Miley, 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 stay. Miley, no. No, Miley. Oh. Can I get some milk? Watch out. The other it, one no, they won't drink right away. No, no, the other one. She, she ah. normally doesn't let me touch her. Wow, it's so fucking cute. That's the placenta. We'll see. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna do anything right now. Yes, they're so freaking cute. I don't know how we could we would find out if they need colostrum. They, but they drink some, right? <laughs> Should let them drink. Yeah, yeah. Let's give it some time. She's doing good. He's calling her. <laughs> hey, Raven! Bring it to her. Okay, my love. Yes, Raven is a uh, over guardian dog. He's not letting anybody go near the goat pen. And uh, when Mighty gets a chance, she's really like focused on looking inside. So by closing this, it's giving the goats privacy and time for her to take care of them. A few times, the one of the babies was like over there, and uh, the fa not the father, the uncle was sounding the alarm because he couldn't, the baby couldn't go back to its mother, because and she couldn't go to him because the other one was feeding. So uh, one time I went in, brought it back, and then uh, Benny was quiet after that. <laughs> The other time was uh, Divine went in. But the dogs, this is a problem. And it's Marima related, I'm sure. 
Willow is like super chill. He doesn't give a thing about the the goats or the other animals, but his food though. If his food is near, he's very uh, territorial about it. And he will he will attack them for protecting his food. Even though there's like unlimited, you know, they never he never has to go hungry. Anyway, so yeah. But I feel it's important because look, you can see my leaves on at the back there. So, because that's gonna be putting too much pressure on the goats. And uh, so, look at my. Miley, Miley, what are you doing? There's a lot of these little frogs. Look, there's another one right there. Super windy day without uh, my divine here. So I'm doing the round for the animals, the goats, all I had to do is give them water, it's done, the babies are like <laughs> moving around, <laughs> so now I'm gonna do the chicken, they need some water, oh the wind is like really intense and with the tarp moving like that on top, on the roof. It's noisy. Hey, how come you haven't gone out yet? How come is everybody still in here? It's a beautiful day. I'll give you some water and some food. <laughs> but it's a bit scary because uh, it's like uh, raining a lot. Oh, there's a dog there. Come, come in. That was bad. I didn't film. I didn't take you with me. I cut three sheets, so 45. So I'm done now. It's all done, I had my tunes. I have to pick up this, but I'm gonna wait. My back is not quite back to normal. So that'll be it. Now I'm ready to uh, work on the roof and even bring that to the roof. Hey, okay, we're gonna have chicks. It's today's the hatch day. And uh, I, I, I came in, there's... No egg has any cracks, but I heard the chicks. And uh, when I whistled, they responded back. So there's some eggs with chicks in there. We don't know. Uh... Oh, okay, I'll change that after. Okay, so now uh, we don't know when it's gonna start, you know, but. Should be soon. That'd be uh, pretty cool to uh, see that happen live. Exclusive footage with Philip. <laughs> Divine is uh, outside, but look, this little guy is gonna come out. It started to crack. There's a few others that have cracks. It's so exciting. I want to see it happen. I'm not gonna bore you while I wait, but when it is worth, uh, like noteworthy, then uh, I will film. Well. It's too early to do the time lapse. There isn't, there isn't much action happening. There's only really this 
egg that's it's getting bigger but it's so slow that uh, can't just stay here and, <laughs> and watch it happen oh look at you yes you're some tanning yes she's been so curious about the little goats that's insane so all my wood has been marked so this is i've done it these are the last one i just left them on the table so this is where my uh, strapping will go and then uh, on top of that i'll have the metal so the boat is loaded and uh, we're gonna go uh, see how well it floats in case it uh, sinks Your fairy has arrived. <laughs> Will you do us the honor of the christening of uh, our new flagship? What's uh, the name of our flagship? MVV or what is it? Oh, Raven, I'm gonna go get the uh, pack. <laughs> Is that Raven scared? You're going in? Yeah. How are you going to get off that? There's no dock. You have to build a dock first. This is the dock. <laughs> You're not going to fall? I don't know. Did you let go of the thing? Huh? Oh, oh I thought, yeah, for a little motor, it's going to be perfect. I thought you... Uh, this I, will be perfect. Miley, you want to go in there? Yeah. I think we should just get it, the motor from Amazon. And stop messing around. Because this is good. You should come in with me. No. I'm the first person to navigate in these <laughs> treacherous waters. <laughs> oh no, that we find only in the middle of nowhere. I should let you go. I need to concentrate. It's facing the wrong way, the boat. This boat can go backwards too, you know. Hi. And then hold the thing. Yeah. I've got it. <sighs> okay, okay. You can just leave it here. Yeah, this is good. Oh, look, little frogs. You see? Two of them. Really? Oh yeah, it's so cute. <sighs> They're protected here from birds. I can start to taking this apart we're not gonna have any rain tonight so tomorrow I'll uh, finish sealing and get started on the roof so I'm gonna yeah start taking that stuff apart okay so tomorrow morning I start with cleaning this up here I got some screws in that wood remove that wood 
I've got many steps, but I won't tell you, I will show you. So, it's gonna be big in here. And the balcony is gonna be so good. Yes. I can hear them, but it's so slow. There's a few here that are cracked. I thought it was gonna be really quick, but no, it's slow.